My name is Andrew Blumenfeld. I'm a neurologist and I specialize in headache medicine. I direct a large headache center in San Diego, California. Today I'm here to talk to you about Nerivia and it has a lot of unique features. The first is that it's wearable, it's non-invasive, it's non-pharmacologic and it's controlled by a smartphone app. The way the Nerivia works is that it works through a conditioned pain modulation system. So what is a conditioned pain modulating system? Well, this is an internal system that we all have that helps us inhibit pain. Running through our brainstem, we have a descending pathway. And this descending pathway originates in the periaqueductal gray, and it's a method of inhibiting pain impulses from traveling up the brainstem to the thalamus and then to the sensory cortex. This system works with two very specific neurotransmitters, serotonin and noradrenaline. The best way that you can think about this conditioned pain modulation system is if you think about how medicines work for pain. These medications work by increasing the release of serotonin and noradrenaline. And by doing that, they activate the inhibitory system and block the ascending system that's carrying pain impulses up the brainstem to the sensory cortex. So when you look at this diagram, the ascending pathways are shown in red. So in the case of migraine, the trigeminal nerve feeds into the trigeminal nucleus in the brainstem, and then there's an ascending pathway that carries the messages through the thalamus to the cortex. The green pathway is the pathway that inhibits pain. This is the serotonin and norepinephrine pathway. When we use an electrical stimulus that is remote to the migraine site and is applied at a sub-painful threshold, we're able to stimulate this inhibitory pathway so that it blocks the impulses from traveling up to the thalamus and the cortex. So the way that this neurostimulating device works is that it activates the C fibers that are distal to the migraine pain in the upper limb and then sends the impulses up through the brainstem, activating the descending pathway, which will then switch off the ascending pathway from migraine. So this is very different from a TENS unit. A TENS unit works on a gait control theory, and the gait control theory really works locally. When you use a TENS unit, you stimulate A-beta fibers, not C fibers. The A-beta fibers have an inhibitory interneuron that decreases the activity in the C fiber locally. So it will work on locally produced pain but not in a global way to diminish activity throughout the brainstem, as we've been speaking about with the conditioned pain modulation effect that Nerivio brings. In summary, Nerivio is a unique device that has a unique mechanism of action, and it uses electrical stimulation in a peripheral nerve in the upper extremity, and this provides a method of treating pain that is drug-free, that is a wearable device, um, it's not going to have a lot of systemic adverse events and will reduce the need for acute treatments, in, in particular in migraine patients. Um, this is obviously very relevant for our practices where we need to use treatments that have low adverse event profile and decrease the risk of producing medication overuse headache. Thank you.